home, Spikey. Hey, look at you. You know what? We got some chocolate chip cookies with your name oh, on it. Oh, my goodness. Um, he looks good, right? He looks okay. Yeah. He looks great. He looks so good. You are one tough little guy, aren't you? Yeah, yeah, you are. It is so good to have you home, my boy. It is. Kendall, he wouldn't have been discharged this early if the doctors were absolutely sure that he could handle it, okay? Okay. I know. You know what? I think we should get you settled in your room. Yes, we should. Hey. You heard from Aiden? Oh, no, thanks. Um, he's, uh, he's at the shack. He's... Still looking for Zach and Greenlee. <sighs> okay, little monkey, you know what? I think we need to go see your little brother. He's going to be so excited to see you. And, and so is Daddy Zach. When he gets here. Yeah. He wanted to be here, but... Don't look at me like that. Like what? Don't look at me like I'm a widow. Oh my god, it bit me, it bit me! Oh my god, kill it, kill it! You all right? Does it look like I'm all right? Just keep your hand below your heart. Oh my god, is it dead? Is it dead? Is it poisonous? Get rid of it. Oh my god, it is poisonous. I'm gonna die. Keep your hand below your heart. Zach, I'm gonna die. I've been poisoned! Help me! We're down here! Help! No one can hear you. I don't want to die down here, Zach. I don't want to no, die. Okay. Die okay, 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 okay. First aid, first aid. I need, I need, um, um, pressure. We have to, we have to put pressure. The more you panic, the faster the poison's gonna move. Okay, Calm okay. down. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna keep breathing. Keep right, breathing. Sit down. I'm gonna keep breathing. Yes, I'm sitting. I'm sitting. Okay. I'm gonna have to get the poison now. Oh. Close your eyes. Right no way. There. No way, Zach. It hurts too much. No, I can't. I can't. No way. Okay, look at me. It's going to be all right. Okay, now close your eyes. Work with me. Hey, I'm sorry that you didn't get back in time to put Ian down. Oh, no. Are you kidding me? Two boys asleep in their very own bed? Nothing beats that. How about we get some dinner? You want some Chinese? You don't have to stay, Ryan. Do you want some cookies? There's going to be some chocolate chip cookies around this no, place. No, listen to me. I don't need a babysitter, OK? Rachel is here, and Josh is on his way home. I know I'm that. fine. I know. You don't want to leave Spike any more than I do. Guilty. OK. All right, well then, you know what? You guys are welcome to stay. You can call Annie and have her bring Emma. It'll be like old times. They will find him, Kendall. I know. I know. I just, I just wish that Zach were here now. Chinese it is. You want some sweet and sour chicken or sesame? Are you sure? I mean, really sure? Yes, I'm really sure. Annie knows I'm going to be here a while. Okay, all right. Okay. Yes. Both? Both. I want it all. Okay. Hey, this is the Slater house. Yes, that is the address. Exactly. I'd like to place an order, please, for delivery. We'll have a uh, large order of sweet and sour chicken, make an order of sesame chicken, as well as, I don't know, maybe some beef and broccoli and some egg rolls. Yeah, no, no drinks. Thanks, we're good. Thank you very much. About half an hour. So how's Annie? Better. Thank you, now that uh, Richie is locked in a, in a ward. She feels like the whole world is off her shoulders, you know? Oh, she, feels, she feels free. That's good. Ryan, that's, that's great. I'm so happy for you guys. That's what a relief. Hey, I'm sorry if, uh, if I upset you before. I, I really didn't mean to. I'm sorry I snapped at you. It's okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> I don't know what it is. It's like, 
Everywhere I am, I feel like I'm supposed to be somewhere else, you know, ever since the, the crazy accident. I mean, I go into labor and then I hand over Spike to Greenlee. Kendall, what happened is not your fault. Ryan, Spike was in the hospital and I was having Ian. So here I am torn. I, it's like I had to choose between my two sons. Do, do I go to, to, to the, the, the NICU or do I go to the pediatric ICU? I mean, how is anyone supposed to choose? And now Zach is missing and, and Spike is still in and out of the hospital over and over again. Hey, Kendall, it's okay. You can't do everything. You know, you can't, you can't be everywhere. Well, I, I shouldn't even have to choose. I mean, there shouldn't even have to be a choice. My family should be here, home, healthy and safe. And they will be. Look, you hear that? He's here. Zach is not. And I can't look for him and, and take care of my sons at the same time. There's lots of people looking for Zach right now, lots. I made a deal with God for Spike. I told him that if Spike made it through the surgery, that I would... You'd what? I told him that I would confess to the police for setting up Greenlee. But I didn't. I didn't keep my promise. It's all right. How do we know we got all the venom out? We don't know. Great. So what do we do now? We calm down, relax. It just really hurts. Can't we do anything more? Just keep your hand below your heart. It's gonna hurt for a while. Yeah, well, it already does. Hey, Sticks, I'm coming with you, probably. You're not dying. I am dying, just not right now. It's gonna be slow and painful. Okay. There. Here you go. Liquid courage. A little too late. <coughs> You were brave. <laughs> yeah, right. I was scared. I still am scared out of my mind. It's over. Yeah, until more of his friends show up. I'll keep an eye. Well, can you just get rid of him already? Can't do that. Why? He's dinner. Okay, what is with the silence? How did this happen? What, Zach, Spike, Greenlee? I mean, where do we start? You loved Greenlee. I loved her. That was a long time ago. Was it? It's all gone to hell, though, hasn't it? All because I made a wrong decision. Zach made a wrong decision. Ryan, if it weren't for Zach, we, we wouldn't have that little boy in there. I shouldn't have left. I shouldn't have left. I shouldn't have hid things from Greenlee. It hurt her, and honestly, she didn't deserve that. Uh, yeah, okay, that might be true, but you know what? She did her fair share of hurting us back. Do you regret what you did, Kendall? Brian, I almost backed off a bunch of times. Every time I thought about the, the amazing friendship that Greenlee and I once had. But then I would look at Spike, our innocent son. I mean, he, he, he didn't ask for any of this. He, he's, just, he's just an innocent little boy. I mean, and he just had surgery to, to get his hearing back again because of what Greenlee did to him. And you can't forget that? No. I will never forget the pain that she caused our son.